Hey everybody, it's Jen. I have a teeny weeny haul I did today. I wanted to share my stuff with you guys. Uh, the first thing I got is this chain. So I love this. It's just a black kind of plastic feel here. And then it's got uh, more of a metal silver, like a heaviness to it. So this end just lightens it right up. And it's just kind of like enough for um, the neckline. So I really like that. I thought that was cute. And I also picked up two um, nail polishes, both in black. I did some research last night on the best black nail polish and just came up with a whole bunch. And so I wasn't able to really get um, a good feel for what the best black nail polish was. Um, so I picked up this one called Nina and it is Ultra Pro Salon Formula. And it's just black. So it looks like that. As you can see, this is China Glaze nail polish, and it's just like this is two days of wearing. It was totally disgusting, and it's just chipping, like it's taking off bunches of my nails, and this is like brand new put on. So I'm disappointed. This is the color I used right here, so don't buy that, people. This is in um, Royal Tees. I don't like this. I think it might be old. I'm not sure. Anyway, so I got this Nina one in black, and then I also picked up OPI nail polish, nail lacquer, and black onyx. And it's just again another black, which I this one was on one of the top ten that people like for black nail polish. So I'm gonna try these, but I don't know how these will perform yet. But if you guys have a like a favorite black nail polish that you use, please let me know because I really want to try it out. They didn't have any um, China Glaze black, which I normally wear China Glaze. Uh, but after that, I just had a little bit of a bad taste in my mouth, so I want to try another brand. So I did try out these two, and um, I'll let you guys know how I like them. The next item that I got is um, some nail art, and this was from Claire's. So it's just a whole bunch of different um, sort of chains and gems and stuff like that that you put on your nails. And the best part about this is they were having a clearance sale. So this was regular price, $6.25 Canadian. And that was on for half price, so $3.12. And then this one was all the way down to a dollar. So I should probably go back and get some more. Um, but yeah, this is really cool. I like this. So if you have a Claire's near you, check it out because if you're in the US, it'll probably be a little bit cheaper. Um, the next thing I got was at Dollarama here in Canada. And it is just the OPI, what are these called? Pure Lacquer Nail App. So you just apply them onto your nail and then um, I think you just... Let me just read these instructions. So uh, start with a clean, dry, natural nail, remove top clear film, peel strip away from the backing, place the strip on the nail and smooth. So I guess you just like smooth it all out. And then um, crease the strip at the nail edge so you're like bending it over the nail edge and file off the excess in a downward motion. So just file it off like that and then it, the, the remainder will just fall off. So um, yeah, I'm excited to try this. I love this um, pattern. I thought that was pretty cute. So I figured I would give this a go. I've never used these before. So if you like these, give this video a thumbs up and let me know how much you like those. Another thing I got is an eyelash curler. Now I have been so against eyelash curlers for so long. Um, but I have clients that don't have naturally um, bendy eyelashes. Like mine will easily bend um, just here at the, uh, the root area just with holding the wand from my mascara, like holding it in and pressing it up. So mine will naturally bend. And so I just try that on everybody else, but sometimes it doesn't work because um, some of the eyelashes grow naturally downward. And so I picked up um, an eyelash curler from Kala, and this was from um, Winners. I believe this is from Winners. And I got it for $4.99. So I thought this was a really nice one because of the way that it felt. I did check it out before I bought it. It comes with a little plastic guard on it so it keeps it from opening. And then um, you just take the guard off and it's really comfortable and easy to use, especially because it has these black pads on the bottom. And it does come with a spare um, rubber piece. So I really like that. And so I picked that up for, I have two clients tomorrow that I'm doing. So I picked that up for that specifically. Um, so that's another thing that I got. And then I got a bunch of lashes. I did pick up some clothes. I picked up a pair of tights um, and about four shirts, I think. Um, but I also got a bunch of lashes. So I'll show you guys the lashes first. 
Um, the best deal that I got was um, some Ardell lashes that were on for two dollar or two for five dollars, so two dollars and fifty cents because they only had one left. And these are in um, pretty, so they look like that. So they're not super super long, and they do just have a little bit of a gem on them. So I'm thinking I'm going to use these on one of my clients tomorrow because they are really sweet. And I believe that the clients that I have tomorrow don't wear a whole lot of makeup on a regular basis. So this is just a really cute, simple lash with just a little embellishment on them. So I'm going to probably use this for one of them tomorrow. And then I also got this... Um, double lash set with a clear Ardell lash glue. Is this Ardell? I think so. Anyways, um, so there's 108 black, so just very, very simple. A very short, simple lash. Um, and then 120 demis, which are in the shade black down here. And then the lash glue, which is clear. So yeah, I got that. So I'm very excited about those. Probably one of these will go to my um, clients as well because I will be doing false lashes for both of the girls. Um, and the next ones I got are from Sally's. And the first one is Ardell Professional. And it's actually they're all Ardell Professional. And this one is in 105 Black. These are my very favorite lashes to wear other than my own. I mean, you can see I have naturally long lashes already anyways. But um, I do love wearing false lashes like as often as possible. And then I also picked up um, Demi Pixies, which are just these cute ones right here. And I believe these are the ones that are knockoff of the MAC 7s. So I'll probably wear those um, very soon. And then I have Ardell's 134's black, and these just are so dang cute. So I really like those. So yeah, I just picked up like a ton of lashes and um, just some little extra stuff. So I thought I would share that with you guys. If you guys want to see my clothes and stuff, I can do a video of that too. But I just feel like this is more of a beauty channel. So I mean, if you want to see that, leave a comment or thumbs up or something and let me know what you guys think. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching so much, and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye.